This video is about Rashwinder Singh, the nurse from Innisvale that is wanted for murdering Toy Accordingly at Wangetti Beach on the 21st of October 2018. This is the timeline if you want to stop and have a look. Now the day after he allegedly murdered Toya when she was just walking her dog along the beach he fled. He left his family, his wife and children from Innisvale and fled to India. And they know where he is. So let's have a listen to this. But the man wanted in connection with the death of Toy accordingly disappeared overseas. A global manhunt is underway for Rashwinder Singh and Seven News has for the first time tracked down his family in India. Rural Northwest India, the at times tense region bordering Pakistan. Here, outsiders stand out. Locals easily blend in. And it's home to a man who doesn't want to be found. Rajvinder Singh hasn't been seen since fleeing Australia, returning to India a day after the brutal murder of 24-year-old Cairns woman Toy Accordingly at Wongeti Beach over a year ago. Evidence links him to the crime. Police want to speak to him, but first they need to find him. Seven News travelled to the Punjab region following his trail. In his hometown, wary villagers admit knowing him but give little detail. But one eventually takes us to his family home, where we find his uncle. I don't know why he is. I don't have any contact with him. He has never called me. Over tea, relatives confess his disappearance is strange. He was a very simple and uh, silent guy. The local police chief is offering help. We know how to track a person. We can track him. Queensland police tell us they continue to appeal for anyone with information regarding Toya's murder who may have, until now, been unwilling to speak. It's feared the missing man could be hiding out in any number of crowded cities in the area, either side of the border. As difficult as it is to find Rajvinder Singh in this densely populated region, it is only one step in the long road to justice. If Queensland police decide he is the man who committed the murder, seeking and securing his extradition back to Australia would be a complex and lengthy process. What he did in Australia, what happened in Australia, we don't know how was the situation there, how he was behaving there. But local authorities in India stand ready and confident. We will use all of the sources we have to track him and give justice to that family in Australia. Justice that could come by finding a missing man half a world away. In Amritsar, India, Joel Dry, 7 News.